Okay, in this question we're going to look at calculations to do with waves. So the equation that we're going to look at is C is equal to F lambda. Okay, so in this equation C is the speed of the wave. Uh, F is the frequency of the wave. And lambda is the wavelength. Now, to keep all our units properly, uh, you know, in order so that the answer comes out well, we'll try and keep speed, if we can, in meters. We'll try and keep frequency in hertz. And we'll try and keep wavelength in meters per second. Per second. And the wavelength is in meters. Okay. So, in our question, what we're asked for, uh, or what we're told, is that a radio wave has a frequency of 96 megahertz. And then the question to do with that is, what is the wavelength? Okay, so if we look at our equation, we see that we've got a speed, a frequency, and a wavelength. And in our question, we, it looks like we're only given a frequency. But the trick here with this is that we're talking about a radio wave. So because it's a radio wave, we know that C, the speed of the wave, has to be 3 by 10 to the 8 meters per second, which is the speed of light. Radio waves will always travel at the speed of light. So will X-rays, uh, so will gamma rays, UV, infrared, all the different um, types of electromagnetic radiation that there are. So we have C, because even though it's not given in the question, it's inferred in the question. Right, the frequency is 96 megahertz, which is... 96 for the number here then because it's mega you can say it's by 10 to the 6 this bit means this uh, and then it's uh, hertz after that so now we're in SI units for the frequency as well this is in SI units for the speed and we're trying to find the wavelength so let's try that the way we would start this question is we would say c is equal to f lambda and then we'll plug in the values so we'll say 3 by 10 to the 8 is equal to 96 by 10 to the 6 lambda right so to make this easier i'm going to switch the sides i'm just going to move this bit over to this side and this bit over to this side of the equal sign uh, which just makes life a little bit easier for me 96 by 10 to the 6 Lambda is equal to 3 by 10 to the 8, like that, okay? Now, because I got 96 by 10 to the 6 lambda, and I just want lambda, well, what I want to do is divide both sides here by 96 by 10 to the 6 lambda. So 96 by 10 to the 6, uh, I'm going to leave the lambda out here, over 96 by 10 to the 6. So I've divided this side by 96 by 10 to the 6. So because I've divided this side by 96 by 10 to the 6, I have to divide this side by 96 by 10 to the 6. Like this. So these go away. And so you end up with lambda is equal to this. And what we should get. For this, if I get a calculator. One that works. is 3 by 10 to the 8 divided by 96 by 10 to the 6. And I get 3.125 meters. And that's how you do questions using C is equal to F lambda.